What's up guys? Welcome back to another video. Hope you guys are having an amazing Friday. Today I'm going to be telling you the former roller coasters of Knott's Berry Farm. So we're going to get into it. Of course, once I hit the one minute mark. But yeah. So yeah. Knott's Berry Farm only has four four former roller coasters. So this should not be too long of a video. Of course, you guys will see how long it is. I can't see how long the video is until it's done. I mean, I can see it's at 38 seconds right now, but I don't know what time, how many minutes the video will be done. So, yeah. So, like always, subscribe, hit that notification bell so you never miss out when I post a new video. Also, hit the like button and share the video with others because it will really help me out. Let's get right into it. So, we have our first roller coaster, and that is. Boomerang, which opened in 1999 and closed in 2017. This was a Vacoma Boomerang, 935 feet long, 116 feet tall, 47 miles per hour, three inversions, one minute and 38 seconds. I mean, one minute and 48 seconds, and five. It has a G-Force of 5.2. And of course, since it's a boomerang, it only has one train. And it is now relocated to Trans Studio Club Bar as Boomerang Hyper Coaster. I wonder if it's still there. And the um, hang time replaced, re replaced Boomerang. So where hang time is sitting right now is where Boomerang was. If you're wondering. And when my phone decides, decides to load slow, we're com Come on, phone. I'm not playing these games with you today. Hold on, guys. Okay. So, next up, we have the Wacky Soapbox Racers, which opened in 1976 and closed in 1996. It was an aerodynamic steeplechase roller coaster. Now I'm going to be telling you all the, this. Now every track had the same stats. Every track was 1,778 feet long, 27 feet tall, 30 miles per hour, zero inversions. It had single car trains and the trains fit, fit four per train. So that's that. Next up is Corkscrew, which opened in 1975 and closed in 1989. I I believe believe that Corkscrew replaced Steeplechase. I believe I'm pretty sure it replaced Soapbox Racers, but I can't I can't confirm that. And then Boomerang replaced Corkscrew. But Corkscrew was an aerodynamic Corkscrew roller coaster. And if you still want to ride Corkscrew, you can go to Silverwood Theme Park and ride it. 1,250 feet long, 70 feet tall, the drop is 62 feet, 46 miles per hour, and two inversions. And of course, we have our final roller coaster now, which is Wind Jam Jammers Surf Racers, which opened in. 1997 and closed in 2000. It was a Togo Looping Mouse. Both, it had two tracks. Both tracks had the same stats. 1,850 feet long, 69 feet tall, 40 miles per hour, one inversion, and a minute and 30 seconds long. Like I said, it was going to be a short video, so they only have four former roller coasters. So this is the end of the video. If you guys enjoyed today's video, hit that like button, and I'll see you next time. Bye!